Manhattan. U.S. Attorney Preet Bharara holding a news conference on the insider trade, trading charges filed against prominent hedge fund SAC Capital. Take a listen. And which employed the many people responsible for what can only be described as rampant insider trading within those funds. Second, we have filed civil money laundering charges against numerous SAC funds seeking appropriate forfeiture of assets to address SAC's liability. And third, we unseal today the guilty plea of yet another portfolio manager at SAC, Richard Lee, who just this past Tuesday pled guilty to committing insider trading offenses while an employee at SAC. Mr. Lee brings to eight the number of employees so far convicted of or charged with insider trading for the benefit of SAC. What today's indictment against SAC makes clear is this. When so many people from a single hedge fund have engaged in insider trading, it is not a coincidence. It is instead the predictable product of substantial and pervasive institutional failure. As alleged, SAC trafficked in inside information on a scale without any known precedent in the history of hedge funds. As described in the indictment, the scope of illegal trading was deep and it was wide. It spanned more than a decade in time, involved the securities of at least 20 public companies, extended across multiple sectors of the economy, and benefited SAC to the tune of at least hundreds of millions of dollars. Indictment, though.